Hey guys, it's Mo. Welcome to today's video. Today I have a super luxe, super bougie kind of haul. Now, a lot of these products I do plan on doing dedicated videos to. We're talking Lemire, Sicily, Wayne Goss, Sonia G. Did a lot of damage at Beautylish. Neiman Marcus, Nordstrom. Oh my gosh, just. It's a lot. Let's get started. Lots of goodies. It's insane. I know. I love the foundation so much. <laughs> so the first thing that I got is from Le Mer. This is hands down my favorite foundation ever. I currently use it in the shade Honey. 43 it's what I wear today It's what I wear on most days this is amazing so I picked up a darker shade for summer worst case I just mix it with what I already have if it's too dark I got the shade amber 53 and here's what she looks like I found this one to be a little more warm than this one is a little more neutral and she does come with a pump the reason I love this so much is because it has skincare benefits and it's got a little bit of SPF in it, and it's really it wears really well on the skin. It's light. It doesn't give that cakey feel or look to the skin. It's beautiful. Hands down, holy grail, my favorite. So I'm glad that they extended the shade range a little bit, and that I got another shade for summer. That's how much I love it. When I love something, I have to have multiples. <laughs> the next thing I got is from Sicily. It's the Blur Expert Perfecting Smoothing Powder. This powder has some insane claims, and I am ready to see if it works. <laughs> this is what it looks like. It's got a beautiful mirror in the compact, and here's what the powder looks like. There's a couple of ways that you can use it. So definitely subscribe if you want to see when I try this out. Next thing I got is from La Prairie. It's their new, it's upside down. It's their new powder. They came out with all updated um, skin caviar makeup. Uh, the cushion foundation, the powder foundation, the powder. I have been a long time fan of their original powder the cellular treatment loose powder love this stuff it's what I have on today I set my under eyes with this I buff it all over my skin very lightly some it, it does a beautiful job I like this a lot so when I saw that they came out with a new one I had to get it <laughs> and I got the shade translucent 2 because I got the other one in translucent 2 and it works pretty well for me there's three of them uh, there's, I guess, translucent, translucent one and translucent two. It's really heavy, a lot heavier than the other one. It looks like this. So I mean, we're talking. One thing I noticed right away with this, she smells. She has a fragrance. So I think if you don't like that in your makeup, stay away from this. It is a, it's a beautiful smell, but. I kind of think it's a little much. Now this powder has a lot of skincare benefits to it. That's why I lean towards products like this and investing in products like this. That's why we have this type of haul here on my channel. I'm a 30 plus young woman and I like to invest in products. Anyways, this has the skin caviar properties in it which claims to refine skin's textures, smooth the appearance of lines and wrinkles, minimize pores, help with hydration, and it leaves you feeling comfortable. That's foundation for longer wear. Provides natural matte luminous finish. Uh, this one you're getting 40 grams or 1.41 ounces. This one you get a beautiful mirror. And the puff. Oh, hi! 
You want to be in the video? Come. This is my little boy. This is Donatello. Hello, say hi. Say hi, Donatello. Say hi. Hi. No, you can't leave my face. It's got stuff on it. Say hi. <laughs> okay, I have to finish. I have to finish. Okay? I'm telling him about the new little Perry powder. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'll do a video on this. I'm not sure. Comment down below if you would like to see a video on this. I feel like I have a good amount of Le Mer and Sicily. So hopefully that's your gig. Ooh, yes. This was a sign in to me. Although, I don't know. But it's the La Mary, La Mary. The La Mer, the bronzing powder. This I believe is limited edition. I think every year they come out with one. I use on a daily This La Mer, what is this one? Uh, the Sheer Press Powder. I really love this stuff. I carry this with me for touch-ups and I like to buff it sometimes just to finish my makeup. But this is what this looks like and this is very similar. But this one has like a little sunflower. If I maybe take this off you can see that would be great. <laughs> this has a little sunflower. Beautiful. And the actual product looks like this. Oh, it's so pretty. So pretty. I feel like... Now, there's three layers to it. The second one and the third one look like it'll be highlighters for me, but who knows? I'll give it a try. And it does have a scent. But it's very pleasant. I love my Lemur foundation. And they came out with cushions. The Luminous Lifting Cushion Foundation SPF of 20. I got the shades Warm Honey because I have honey in my normal foundation. And then uh, Beige Nude. I forget. Why did I get this color? Anyways, I got those two colors. And let's see. This is what the packaging looks like. It's got a mirror. And a cushion, little sponge. Most always, I never use these kind of applicators, but when it comes to cushion compacts, they're designed for it and they actually do work well with the product. So I'm looking forward to trying this out. Definitely be on the lookout for a dedicated video trying these out. Oh, yes, this is something I've been trying. Love. Okay cats out the bag <laughs> it's the lip uh volumizer lip volumizer from millimere this is something i love like i don't know i've always liked the balm that comes in the little pot but sometimes i don't feel like using my finger and this is so good it's already got its home in my daily my little daily bin so let me show you so what it looks like it's uh it's like a lip it's a gloss, but it's a plumper. It's got the Miracle Broth. It's supposed to be good for your lips. You know, I am a lip balm connoisseur. I, um, I've been kind of just wearing gloss, keeping it simple on my lips lately, so. I'll show you. It, it does give you that, it does give you that tingle, plumpy feel that a lot of these type of products give but this one I find it conditions my lips and my lips feel really good I had to try this and I do like it so far I don't really have any other excuses as to why I got it I just got it <laughs> I grabbed another one of the uh, lip balms the one that comes in the little pot because uh, the uh, La Mer lady La Mer lady she was telling me that when you use them together, you get even more benefits of the actual product. So I figured why not get another one, use them together and see how it goes. Just a little pot. 
it's like that. You're getting, let me see, you're getting 0 0.32 ounces or 9 grams. Now this is something I'm really excited about because this is what I want to call my new skincare slash makeup primers cocktail. <laughs> um, oh yeah, and I got a sample when I went. It is from Sicily. So I got the Global Perfect Pore Minimizer. This one refines, smooths. And then I got the Double Tensure. So I got these two from Sicily. This one I plan to use in the center of my face. But I like this area to be smooth. So I want to try that there. And a lot of people love this. A lot of people recommend it. So I figured I'd give it a try. And it's got lots of beautiful skincare benefits to it. And like I said, I'm in my mid-30s. Why not? That's what this looks like. So this one you get what an ounce. So this primer you get an ounce. This one, I think someone told me that the milk makeup made something similar. So I don't know. I haven't tried that, but I went with this one because I feel like I'll get more skincare benefits from it and I'll feel good about that since it's something that will be sitting on the skin for so long and I'm excited like I, I of all of this I think I'm the most excited about that uh, and it's something that you'll not see but I'm excited nonetheless I got the La Mer replenishing oil exfoliator I what exfoliator was I using I've been using the Tata Harper uh, it's like a daily exfoliator for the skin and I like it a lot but I've always wanted to try this so here's what this looks like I'm excited to try it I've completely run out of my other exfoliator so it was the perfect time to be my bougie self and swallow myself and get it so I got it <laughs> another skin care from La Mer um, I have been doing and using the same skincare for a number of years now and here and there I'll try something new and incorporate it here and there but I really wanted to switch all of my skincare. I got a lot of samples of these products before I committed to the full size because I know it's pricey. I noticed my skin reacts really well to a lot of La Mer products. So I got the tonic and this is La Mer's toner. I do like their essence as well, but I do love the Tatcha essence a lot too. So we'll see. But this is what this looks like. It's beautiful and I'm excited. Can't wait to get a little miracle broth all over my face. <laughs> I really like using facial mist before I do my makeup. I have been using this one. So I'll do my I'll do my skincare and then I'll come and I'll sit and right before I actually start my makeup I'll spray um, a mist with some skin benefits to it on before I put my primer. I just find it gives a little extra plump, a little suppleness, a little extra moisture to my skin. And I got the La Mer because why not? This mist helps hydrate, renew, and rebalance the skin. Oh. So this internal magnet continually charges ingredients to, main, to maintain optimum potency for more energized and revived appearance. And I got the set, the face set and eye set, all of them here. I love Wayne Gosbert, a friend of mine. Highly suggested, highly recommend. And I've been watching quite a few videos. Kinky Sweat, Michelle Wong, quite a few of you really rave about them, so I'm excited. And they're pretty comparable to Wing Goss, and that's all I've used for a while. So I got those, and I'm excited to try them. Lovely husband gifted me with these Chikahota brushes. They're like the limited edition with Beautylish. They are so beautiful. 
so so pretty and they come in a little uh case as well i think these actually just came back in stock on beauty loose too i really like investing in my brushes because this is something i'm going to use for a long time and all the brushes i have of wayne goss i've had for years and they work they work just as good as the first time two three years later so i got this bag Beautylish put them in this bag which was cool i got two sets of wingoss brushes i think the anniversary set or something yeah anniversary set volume two and then i got his synthetics his synthetic brushes which Synthetic brushes work wonders. So this Wayne Goss brushes always come in like a little canister, which I I like because good for travel. Very good for travel and just storage. Beauty Delish is very keen on details and I can always appreciate that. So here are all of his brushes. Foundation, eyes, the whole shebang. Beautiful as always. And the synthetics look come in the same canister. And the synthetics is actually a set of four. Face and eyes. And he did say that you can use just these brushes to do your whole shebang. I'm excited to try synthetics from Wingos. So the rest of my goodies are from Beautylish. Um, I got this Viseart palette. I have one Viseart palette and it's the best Viseart palette and this is like a little guy that you can travel with. It's cute. I like the colors. I wanted to try something new from them. This is what she looks like. It's I'd say this is the size of a business card. I have a little mirror. I'm not... yeah it's pretty okay. It's small but it'll do the trick if you're in a pinch. And they are removable. The way it's designed, you can pop them out. Beautiful colors. Hmm. And the last product from Beautylish comes in this packaging, which I can appreciate. Nothing's happening to this in transit. It's from Natasha Denona. This is the tan palette. I watched Kinky Sweat's video. I had to get it. So here's what she looks like. And this is a bronzer, tan, highlighty kind of palette. I use my Tom Ford bronzer. I love that bronzer. I don't want another bronzer, but when Natasha Denona does something, I need it. <laughs> so we have four products. We have a glow cream base, another glow, another glow powder, and then the bronzing powder. So. I'm excited to try this. I definitely think I want to do a couple of tested new makeup videos. I do have some Sephora products that I'm going to share in a haul video. That way I can do a couple of tested new makeup videos and try all of these things. And getting myself back into routine here. Comment down below if there's any products that I showed that you're dying to hear about. Comment down below. Let me know if you've tried anything. Thank you guys so much for watching. Me and Donatello here are going to go clean up our mess we made. Right? Yeah. And hang out. And edit. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay beautiful. I'll see you soon.